hello everyone welcome back to the channel today i'm going to give you a quick update on ethereum classic i'm going to address some missing data okay which makes me think somebody's trying to hide something and also i am going to um just give a quick overview of um, ethereum classic on grayscale and how it actually works so let's jump right in so first things first so today while i was on my live stream somebody asked a question and that question got me very excited because they uh they looked at i think the person's name was mr singh okay last name was singh um they they realized that we are actually missing data for the end of april and guess what since november they have released data consistently every two weeks without fail okay but there hasn't been any such spike since november so my question is, what are they hiding? What is happening? Okay. All right. Check this out. They released a report for end of November, middle of December, end of December, middle of January, end of January, middle of February, end of February, middle of March, end of March, middle of April, but they skipped end of April. And guess what? Tomorrow is the 15th. That's when they're supposed to release middle of May. So I will come back here and check early tomorrow to see if they release that one. So they skipped end of April and now there's a report for end of May that's also due. And why are they skipping, uh, you know, reporting the data? I'll tell you why. Take a quick look at this. Um, let's go here. This is the Ethereum Classic Trust, okay? I'm going to scroll down here just so you have a... Uh, so the green, okay, the green represents the actual price of ethereum classic okay and then the um the gray the gray represents the price of ethereum classic um shares which is etcg that's on here and guess what this is the conversion let's take a quick look at the con conversion right here um one etc share is actually 0.885 ethereum classic okay so when i say one share is one ethereum classic it's close enough it's close enough right um so one share is 0 0.88 now so check this out this is the data they haven't released yet okay uh this is what's happening this is this overtaking uh, for the green to completely overtake the gray it hasn't happened before to that tune it's never happened before so i'm pretty sure i'm pretty sure somebody's in a hot seat somewhere uh, because if you haven't watched my previous video go check it out okay go check it out on etc it tells you why i believe it's been heavily heavily shorted and i went and backdated uh, and found the price for each date and i know it has been heavily shorted and they have not covered okay but they are delaying because they know that if they release this data, you know, uh, people are sharks are going to smell blood in the water <laughs> and pounce. Okay. If you have enjoyed this video so far, please, please, please like and subscribe. It goes a very long way to help the channel. All right. Let's get back right on. So um, they are delaying, but, but I know, okay, I know that there is information that somebody is probably trying to hide again i'm not a financial advisor okay this is this is just my youtube channel this is for entertainment purposes only huh <laughs> all right so this is what happened this is information we want to know we want to know how many more people shorted it if you guys were happily shorting it all the way here thinking oh it's too expensive i'm pretty pretty sure that when it got up here you were more than happy to short it again you even shorted it up here you even shorted it all the way up here so we need to see some of that data that's what we're you know we need that's what we need to know now just to put some things into perspective uh um the um, ethereum classic assets under management for grayscale is worth 1.2 billion this has doubled since uh, august of last year and uh but grayscale by itself okay is let me go to the about page here oops this is the total okay and and of course bitcoin and um, ethereum make up a larger percentage of this and these are the assets that um, um grayscale manages this is it these are the only coins that they are you know research 
okay, has led them to manage. And Ethereum Classic happened to be among the select few. We have Bitcoin Trust, Bitcoin Cash, Chainlink, Decentraland, Ethereum Trust, Ethereum Classic, Filecoin, Horizon, Litecoin, uh, Livepeer, uh, Stella Lumens, XLM, and Zcash. That's it. That's the only trust that they have. And if you guys want a, a more detailed video on how, how the, uh, if you guys want a more detailed video on how uh, the Grayscale Trust works and how premiums are determined and how the, the price of each share is determined, I could make that as well. But right now we are interested in a squeeze. I want to see a squeeze. <laughs> and uh, I will just be hunting for data. Once I find the data, I'm going to bring it out there. Um, I think I think something something is up. So it's, it's going to get quite interesting here uh, very soon. So that's it. That's all I have for today. I will see you in the next